All right, guys, here's a tutorial nobody asked for. How to here is how to beat all three phases of Capuchin Horror VR. So let's get started. As soon as you spawn into the map, you're gonna notice two things. One, you have a timer on your left hand that is three minutes long, and on your right hand, you have a map. Basically, the blue square on the map is your location, and the red square, and the red squares are where the scary monkeys are. Well, right now, since of May 2023, right now it's May 2023, the game is still in development, so the scary monkeys do not move around. So you can literally just stand in one spot for the entire game, and the scary monkeys will not get to you. They will not chase you. Right now, the only way you can lose is if you touch them, so be careful. And they can't chase you, so, I mean, you can just stay in one spot for like the whole three minutes. Well, of course when they update the game and when it gets out of beta, yeah, they'll probably fix this issue. But just for now, you can just, well, yeah, right now this, this phase is very easy, so here is sped up footage. When the level ends, you'll just spawn back in the bed in the treehouse, so just go to game modes and queues and tap option 1 to go back. <laughs> When you first spawn into phase 2, you will notice that there is rocks behind you, so keep that in mind. So go ahead and run straight until you see the monk, the scary monkey in the row. And then just run behind you in the direction the rocks will disappear. And again, since the game is still in beta, the scary monkeys cannot get you. So at this point, it's just a matter of memorization. You just have to run in the correct pattern. It is kind of easy to get lost. Oh, what the fuck are that monkey scared? Okay, whatever. So, you will notice that there is another scary monkey, like, after this point. Don't worry, it's not- the monkeys won't chase you because the game is still in beta. So, what you're gonna want to do is after you see this monkey, you're gonna run back in the same direction. And, yeah, there was rocks there, but now they're gone. And from this point... Point. It's just a matter of memorization. Once you memorize the whole path, you're you're good. You're good. So here is sped up footage of me running through the path. After some running and you get to this point, you will then notice that there is a wooden bridge and the wooden bridge breaks and nothing happens if you try to jump over it. As you can see here, I tried to jump over, there was just that weird picture of the cat making the middle finger, and uh, yeah, once you fall down the hole, you will spawn into phase 3. So as I'm falling down this hallway right now, this is the entrance to phase 3. Uh, since I'm already in phase 3 right now, I don't have to put that corny transition thing, okay. So when you fall down, you will notice there is rocks behind you. Keep that in mind. Remember there is rocks there. So then you're going to run, a capuchin will fall, and there's going to be a gun, okay? Basically, also, like, you will hear some music once the music is done. Now, watch, see, there's a hole in the rock. Basically, just do what I'm doing, pretty much. Just, like, kind of crawl under the rock a little and shoot the monster. When the monster is dead, the rocks will disappear. It kind of takes a long time to kill the monster, so the... The rest of this footage will be sped up, so, uh, here you go. As soon as the boss dies, as you are about to see right here, yeah, a whole, a whole army of scary monkeys will spawn, so then you just have to run behind you where the rocks were, and you will have a flashlight on your gun. It is kind of hard to run with one hand, while keeping the flashlight up, so keep that in mind. Also, do not be worried too much about these scary monkeys. They are a lot slower than you. And also, this path is a one-way path. It's not a maze. It just has a whole bunch of turns. So it's pretty much... It's, it's basically impossible to get lost. Like, if you get lost, you have the IQ of a Pop-Tart. So, yeah, don't worry. The scary monkeys are very slow, but once, but if they do see you, they become really fast all of a sudden, and they stay fast, so be careful. And it is kind of scary, because you don't know if they're going to all of a sudden speed up, like if they see you or something. Now, I'm sorry if this video sounds long, and if I'm talking too much, but I just want to give a best detailed description. Okay, so at the end, you will see this white light, and as you can see in the video here, I'm waiting for the monkeys to come, so I can just jump in so i can just like jump in as soon as they come by and like they'll get mad and stuff so 
I know it might sound like I'm talking too much, but I want to make this video as detailed as possible. So while you're still watching, go ahead and like and subscribe. I would highly appreciate it. And like, thank you for 10,000 subscribers. I mean, really. And yep. Whoop. Bye bye, sucker. Bye bye, sucker. And here you guys go. This is the end of the video. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And drop a comment if I should uh, make. If there's like any other videos that I should make. So goodbye for now. Oh, and this is the message for the scary monkeys in the game. Goodbye, sucker. Oh, scary.